Good morning. If somebody was to ask me what's the most common uncalled for mistake that people are making with these lawnmowers and these motors, I'm gonna say it's the starter. Uh, people have a habit of wanting to hit a starter with a hammer. There's absolutely that no good can come out of that. These starters have magnets on the inside of them. And when you hit them with a hammer, you bust them magnets. These starters are tough. I mean, they, they, they really are. Most of the time, it's not the starter's fault, but he catches the whipping. A lot of times, it's the battery. A lot more times, it's going to be the bowels is out of adjustment and it won't come past the compression stroke. Here's an easy way we can test this. What I want you to do is I want you to take out the starter. Take out, excuse me, take out the spark plug in the motor. When you take out the spark plug in the motor, you release the compression on the engine. Therefore, it, it'll tell you a whole lot. It'll tell you if the battery's weak, if it turns over real slow and don't sound like it's got any power or no want to in it, it's gonna be the battery. I see a lot of problems with the battery. Now, I'm gonna show you what happens when you hit these starters with a hammer. I don't know if you can see that or not. I hadn't been into this starter here, so this is a little bit of a potluck deal. But I tried to turn it over and it wouldn't turn over, so this is what I figured was wrong with it. I'm gonna pull a, I'm gonna try out of it, it won't even come out. But if you look right in here, you'll see the uh I'm not wanting to hit it with a hammer I fuss so much, so I'm not gonna do it. I'm not gonna let it whoop me either. Ah. <laughs> look on the inside of that. That's the result of when you hit it with a hammer. A lot of people come in here and I, I, I grab the bending gear and go to turn it and it won't turn over. And I say, what's, what's wrong with it? It won't start. So well, have you hit it with a hammer? No, sir, I hadn't hit it with a hammer. Well, I look right here and there's all kind of little pecks on the side of it. Well, who done this? I hit my brother-in-law done it. Y'all, I got a good brother-in-law. He would never do nothing like this, but he gets the blame for a lot of it. Uh, what I want you to do is I want you to take the spark plug out of it. I want you to turn it over. When you turn it over with the spark plug out of it and you ain't got any compression or no resistance in this motor, it's gonna let you know a lot. It's gonna let you know if the battery's weak. It's gonna let you know if everything on the inside of the motor is all right, like a rod being out of adjustment. It tells you a lot just by taking a, a spark plug out of the motor and turning it over. That's a good thing to do. Y'all, don't hit it with a hammer. I mean, that right there, is a costly mistake. It absolutely does no good whatsoever. Check your battery. Make sure you've got a good battery charge on it. And let's go with it from there. Thank you.